Y'all, I cannot keep these children fed and I cannot be the only one that's going through this. Like summer is killing my grocery budget and it's like the older my kids get, the more food that they eat and I just, ugh. Welcome back to the channel for another video today. Um, so we are at Sam's Club and we are at Sam's Club. There's my pickup sign doing a very large pickup order because like I said, I cannot keep my children fed. This order is $400 of pretty much just straight food. And I'm going to be doing another video kind of on like the before and the after I realize I'm filming that lady who might not want to be filmed. Um, the before and after of like why I found the need to go to Sam's Club again and what it looks like after like kind of the fully stocked type of video that I haven't done in a while. Um, today's video is just going to be the haul, but y'all, we have nothing to eat right now. I, um, what sparked this Sam's Club pickup actually was the fact that I did, um, last night we came home from the pool and I went to make dinner and it was like one of those kind of find your own night and nobody could find their own. Nobody could find anything to eat because it was just so empty. So I think they ended up eating like the last few chicken nuggets. I had uncle Ben's rice, like minute rice with cheese and butter for dinner last night because there was nothing, literally nothing like to eat at all. Um, and then I got on Sam's club and I made out this order. So yeah, I got a lot of stuff. Hopefully this holds us all over for a little while. And the most exciting part is that my yogurt was back in stock. Y'all know that I love the honey vanilla yogurt and it has not been in stock for, I don't even know how long. And it was this time. And so I got three of them. So that's like the, when I went on Sam's club and saw that they had it, it's always the search, first thing I search for. I was like, yep, doing this. So yeah, this is a $400 order and I feel like I just spent $500 after the beach, y'all. I just, I'm telling you, I don't know if it's the pool or it's just the fact that it's summer. I think it's all of the above, but my kids are eating me out of house and home. So here I am Saturday morning with my wet hair because it's going to rain and, uh, because I'm not heating my hair right now. So I took a shower, got in the car and I'm picking up my order. So let's do this thing. Let's do this $400 Sam's Club haul. Okay. I'm back from Sam's Club. I have it all laid out here. And we're just gonna go ahead and jump into it because it is a lot. And I'll kind of tell you about meals and stuff as I go along. Why is that cabinet always open? That cupboard is never closed. I cannot get anyone to keep it closed. Okay, let me turn you around and share with you what I got. Hi, Bryson. Okay, I really should have probably put some of it on the counter because it is just so packed on here, but this is what we're going with. So I got two things of strawberries. Um, they're definitely going out of season, but they look okay. They'll do, especially in yogurt bowls. So I got two of those and then sticking with produce. I also went ahead and got a thing of blueberries for snacking and a thing of sweet globe grapes, which are my absolute favorite green grapes in the whole entire world. So I got that fruit and then we did pick up a few other produce items. I got some mini cucumbers for me and Kylie. We both really like these some romaine hearts. We're going to be having tacos this week and then also salads with um, the rotisserie chicken. We're going to cut it up and put it on salads probably tomorrow night. So that is what the rest of the lettuce will be used for. And then I got a 10 pound bag of potatoes. I don't know if we need 10 pounds of potatoes. <laughs> we'll eat them, but you can't beat the price of them. But we are going to be making some in the air fryer a couple times this week um, for like sides for different meals. So I got a 10 pound bag of potatoes. And then this is the star of the show, the whole milk, honey, vanilla, Greek yogurt. If you've been around, you know that I love this stuff. I can inhale it. It is so good. Um, and you can't beat the price. It's 48 ounces is like five bucks at Sam's Club you can't beat the price anywhere else. And I think theirs tastes the best. So I got three of them because I don't know when they will be in stock again. Now they have a date on them of August the 12th. It is only July the 6th. These will get eaten by the time they are ready to go out of date. So yay, so excited about that. I got some sour cream because we're going to be having tacos this week and we didn't have any. Um, we have lots of cheese things here. So sharp cheddar cheese for eating with crackers and just, you know, for snacking. I got a two pack of sharp cheddar cheese. 
because we were completely out of that. String cheese, because again, we had like four or five left. My kids are just eating like crazy. And then I got a huge thing of mozzarella cheese. I think this was like 13 or $14. But when we do homemade pizza, we use a lot of cheese. So this week, we're actually going to be doing some little... Um, like stuffed pizza things with Rhodes Rolls because I bought those Rhodes Rolls last week that we didn't end up using. So I figured this would be good for that. Um, and then hopefully I will freeze half of it and have some for the next time that we do homemade pizza. I also got a whole thing of chicken tenderloins. We are out of the ones that we bought. I think it was two weeks ago when I went to Sam's Club. So I got another bag of those. Um, I also got the flame grilled Angus Choice Beef Patties. These are a great thing to have on hand in the summertime because you can just throw them on your griddle when you get home from the pool and you have a meal in like five minutes. They cook up so fast, even with just some chips and fruit. Easy peasy meal. So I went ahead and grabbed a bag of those. This bag usually is like two to three meals for us, depending on how many everybody eats. Now, one of the big things that Bryson and all the kids really said that they needed was like lunch options that they can make for themselves. So I grabbed several things for that. I got the Pizzeria Uno steak and cheese thingy mabobbers. Chris actually likes these too. I think I've never tried one, but um, every time we get them, they go pretty fast. So I got those. I also went ahead and picked up the Red Baron deep dish singles. You get six four cheese and six pepperoni. So Kylie usually eats the cheese and then Bryson will eat um, the pepperoni ones. They had my pasta in stock this time. They didn't have it last time we were without for a while. So this one, you get two boxes of penne, two boxes of spaghetti and two boxes of elbows. So that should last us a few weeks at least. The girls are really into just eating like butter noodles with a protein for lunch or if it's like a meal that they don't like, noodles is the easy go-to thing. So grabbed that, happy that they had that this time. I got Bryson some Prime and Chris drinks these too, but Bryson mostly takes them to the pool and I want him to stay hydrated at the pool, especially with how hot it's been. So this one, you get five lemonade, five strawberry lemonade and five blue raspberry. So I'm sure those won't last very long. This is new. So they finally released their summer palette, um, their summer palette of flavors, as it says. Now, I don't know that I've actually tried. I know I haven't tried the key lime for sure, but in this variety pack, you get 12 key lime, 12, uh, wa those are watermelon, and then six peat beach plum. The beach plum one, this blue one here, is my one of my absolute favorites. It's in the other pack as well, the one with the lemoncello. I'm hoping I like the key lime more than I liked the lemoncello, but this is such a fun, bright green pack, you know, for summertime. So I got two of them to go ahead and be stocked for a while on LaCroix. You guys know as well as I do that these won't last very long and Brittany will drink them all in like a week and a half, but you know, one can hope. We were completely out of Little Bites and I actually had to buy these um, at, at Food Lion last week and I hated the fact that I had to pay $4.99 for five Little Packs because these are like $8 for 20 So definitely get your Little Bites at Sam's Club or Costco. They're so much more cost effective there. But I got a back of those. I got a couple of chicken options for the kids. So I got one of the crispy chicken strips. Bryson and Kylie like those ones. And then one of the white meat chicken nuggets. Everybody likes the nuggets, but Bryson and Kylie specifically like those. So hopefully these last us a while because I bought a bag at Food Lion last week and they were gone within like two days. So I'm telling y'all, can't keep these kids fed. Um, the next thing I got is the club snack crackers for Chris and Kylie. They like these. They'll eat those with that sharp cheddar cheese. We did need just a couple of like bathroom thing. So we needed some shampoo and conditioner. So I went with the Tresemme Ultimate Moisture one. And then we also needed some body wash. So this one is the Caress White Peach and Orange Blossom. This is my all time favorite scent. Um, the Daily Silk one is like, if I'm gonna gravitate towards one, it's pretty much always going to be that one. It's so like fresh and clean smelling. I love it and it's affordable. It's like 10 bucks for two huge ones. Coming around this way, we have a few snacky items. I haven't bought Dots pretzels in a while, so I went ahead and got these. Kylie really likes these. Bryson does too, but Kylie's the bigger eater of the Dots pretzels, I think, so I got those. I also got a bag of Cool Ranch 
Doritos. We have some in little bags, but I wanna save those for the pool um, just to make life easier there with the individual bags. So I figured the big bag they could eat at home. And then Bryson's favorite is the sweet and spicy chili or spicy sweet chili. He will eat this in two days, even though it's a huge bag. He'll eat that, it'll be gone. Probably already gone as you're watching this video. Um, two little like just quick and easy meals for us to have over the next couple of weeks. This is the rotisserie chicken enchiladas. We buy these often, love them so much. And this feeds us all. They're pretty big. Um, and they're stuffed with, oh, well, obviously they're stuffed with the rotisserie chicken, which is delicious. And then the chicken Alfredo, which we love. That's another fan favorite around here. I usually will add some more noodles to this, which it doesn't take very long to cook versus buying two of um, these. Cause it is like $13, I think. But usually like by the time Chris and Bryson get their serving of this, there's not much left. But again, just really easy, quick meals that we can pop in the oven when we get home from the pool or whatever, you know, ease. These were a treat, obviously. These are the two bite brownies. Somebody brought these to the 4th of July party at the pool and we all loved them, like so much. So much, in fact, that I brought them home. They're over there. The person that brought them left them. There they are. And I was like, well, I'm gonna take them home with me. I contributed lots of stuff to that party that I left there. So to be fair, we just traded. Uh, but anyway, everybody loved these. So I decided to add them to the order. I think they were only like 12, or no, I'm sorry, $10, like nine and some change. Um, and I know that the girls will probably eat some tonight when my, Bryson and I are going to a baseball game tonight and with his friend and the girls are gonna have ice cream. So I'm sure they'll be adding this to their ice cream tonight. We needed more chocolate chips, especially since I got three yogurts to go with all of the uh, yogurt bowls that we're going to be eating and chocolate chip pancakes and, you know, all of the things. Kylie's favorite, favorite thing ever is this Panera Bread mac and cheese. I always buy this four pack of them for her when we go to Sam's Club. So I went ahead and picked that up for her. This haul is never ending, y'all. This yellow rice, we didn't have any rice. And this is one of our favorites, especially, I mean, it goes with like everything, literally everything. If you need a quick meal, cook up some chicken and toss it in here with like a green pepper and an onion that you sliced up, delicious. Like add some queso to it, you're great. Some black beans, perfect. You know, you can do so much with this. So this is like $5 for this huge container of it, much cheaper than buying little boxes of it at Food Lion. I got a rotisserie chicken. This is kind of like a staple now when I go there. We're gonna slice this up and have it on the salad tomorrow night for dinner. And the kids will probably just eat some of it plain. Um, they're not huge salad eaters, but Kylie does like a salad, so maybe she'll have one, but that's the plan for that. And then I have a few, I think like bread options and then that'll be it. So bread for Chris, we still had a whole thing of bacon in the freezer, so I didn't buy any more bacon, but he eats bacon and bread or bacon sandwiches, whatever for breakfast, pretty much every morning. Sometimes he slaps an egg on, sometimes he doesn't. So he needed some loaf bread for the next couple of weeks. One thing of muffins, again, always a staple when we go to Sam's Club, $4.98. I love to see that they're still sticking with the same price and not still increasing. And then the final thing that I got is this pack of different, of um, like Italian loaf breads. We like to use these for all, I mean, everything, sandwiches, garlic bread with, um, like spaghetti and stuff like that. We eat it for everything, just with meals, whatever. So I like this big pack because it's the most cost-effective and you can slice these up for like sandwiches or whatever. So I got that. I think they are like five bucks, $6.98. Not a bad price for six of them. So that is the entire haul for the day. I hope that you enjoyed this video. If you did, please don't forget to give it a thumbs up and come back on Wednesday as we are going to be doing the before and after of my kitchen after I finally stock it with food and probably with my food line order as well. So there's that. See y'all on Wednesday and I hope you have a great start to the week. Storms we chase are leading us and love is all we'll ever trust.